hi everyone welcome to my channel today i'm actually doing my best friend's hair i kept some hair out in the front and i braided the rest so the hair that i'm using today is the innocence easy crochet deep wave 12 inches in color four and this is what it looks like y'all only bought this hair for like a dollar 99 and i got a few packs so i wanted to see what it looked like with it being crocheted in so what i do is i take my crochet needle and i pull it through the bottom part of the braid and I pull the hair through the braid from the top. And when I do this, I'm going to only take about an inch of one part of the hair and pull it through the loophole. After I do that, I'm gonna pull through the other side fully and I'm just gonna pull down. Now you guys will see that I've tried a few methods just trying to figure out like what works best for this hair because I did feel like it wasn't as kinky so I had to do a little bit extra with the hair. So this time what I did is I pulled the needle through from the top and pulled the hair from the bottom. And one side I just pulled about an inch of that side in and then I took the other side and I pulled it all the way through. And what I did after that is it still wasn't as secure so I took a piece of hair from each piece and I tied it in a knot and this is going to secure the hair so if you do try this hair I would advise to try this method and I do feel like the hair will stay so it really won't move and yeah this will definitely help with that now you guys I did notice with this hair it was so like so much of a deep wave in the package but once you look whenever you start to put the hair on the hair it doesn't it doesn't look as much of a deep wave as on the package but that's okay so this hair is though to me kind of high maintenance just because you need to put mousse in it I typically don't even put mousse in my crochet hair however I feel like once I start putting more of this hair in, you'll see. Just keep watching the video and you'll notice that the texture of the hair, not even the texture, but the wave of the hair just starts to be different. It looks more frizzy. It doesn't look more of a defined curl or defined wave, as I should say. But overall, the hair came out and it looks so stinking cute. And I love the fact that I left some of the hair in the front out just so I'd be able to blend it. And yeah, you guys, if you have any questions, put it down in the comment box below if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel and definitely like this video and keep watching I wanted to add that some parts of the hair as I was putting it in I did not go the extra mile to put the knot at the end however some parts I did it just whenever I was doing it I just felt it as I was going and if it felt like it was gonna slip then I added that extra knot at the end but if it feels like the hair is not gonna slip or anything y'all don't need to add it just figure out what worked best for you